Uh, hello guys, my name is Essen and in this video I'm going to explain to you that how um, when your business grows, like uh, when your real estate business grows, then how Podio can help you in managing your business, okay? So uh, everyone uh, in, uh, in, the, in the US market and uh, in the Europe market, they have made Podio as a standard tool for managing their real estate business. So we will look into that, uh, how, uh, what features this tool can have and how it looks like once a complete system is set up into client's workspace. Okay, so uh, we are aware that Podio has different plans. So uh, for using this uh, CRM system, you must have a Podio premium account. Okay, uh, it just charges $24. If you compare this pricing with other tools, you will see that their, their pricing is very high and um, uh, it's very affordable. And at the same time, it has a lot of features. We can connect other tools with this software. So we will look into this. But in this video, I'm just going to explain to you that how um, this system looks like and what features it can have into the system. So the first thing is that um, we should be able to bring our team into, uh, into the CRM. Like if we have five agents, we have cold callers and other people who are going to use this system. So this um, system must have a feature to, uh, uh, to you know, invite them and manage their roles, what permissions they have. So these things are possible here. So if you want to invite your team members, you can simply click here, you can provide their email address. And if they have Podio account, they can easily see um, this workspace on their system, on their Podio account. So you can invite all of your team members and you can give them different roles from these sections, from this section. They have different roles. I will create a separate video which will explain this, uh, these different roles. So once you uh, provide their email address, you can click on this button and then you can invite them here. So uh, in Podio, uh, we will look into its dashboard first. So uh, if you want to place your logo, your company logo here, you can place it here. Uh, it's a default logo of Petronix and it's showing here. Uh, you can provide your phone number, email address, all this information here so that when um, anyone opens, uh, uh, any team member uh, opens CRM, they can have an idea that uh, what, uh, you know, what we are doing, what, what our business is and what is the important contact information. We can display anything which is very important for our business in this section. Okay, so here, um, this is a second system. Uh, it's, uh, it's specific to a client. So it's a template which is installed into client's workspace if they request for, um, you know, for, for, for my services. So if you need uh, this template to be created and then it is customized for your needs, you can request them uh, these things on my email address. You can, you know, I am available on different platforms so you can contact me anytime. So this is a custom system which is developed, which is a call rail based system. So a client have different requirements. We are not people who have a, who just have a template and we install it into client workspace. If client have custom requirements, then we ful fulfill them according to their needs. So this is a custom system. It has its own values, own way of managing business. I will go into this uh, uh, also, but first I will show you my dashboard. There uh, are template dashboard. So, uh, you know, your leads are coming from different sources, like uh, from your website, from Facebook ads. Uh, you may be having a lead source like MLS and different other sources from where your leads are coming. Uh, you want to track that how much leads are coming into the system. Then we can create a dashboard, you know, a, a, a report like this. So this will show that how much leads came this month uh, into the system, like just 11 uh, came into system. So seller leads is, a, 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 is an app which is containing some qualified leads. This is the app which is containing just uh, prospects, some leads which are not, uh, which are, uh, you know, just prospects. They are not even called as leads. They are just coming from external sources into our system. Okay. So these will be going into incoming leads app. I will explain everything in detail, but I'm just going to you, give you an overview. So similarly, um, uh, contracts, if you have uh, integrated some um, uh, contract e-signature service, then it will show, this section will show you that um, how much contracts you have sent and uh, you can track these things here. You can get an idea from here. Similarly, profit generated monthly, like you can see from here that 
how much profit is generated. This is not showing actual uh, like uh, recent values uh, because uh, this is a demo uh, template. So once it is installed into client's workspace, then there are some like uh, live values which are showing into, into the system. So uh, here, uh, sales per month, sales per year. So these things are present here. Similarly, SMS per month, emails per month, so this, these are different counts which will be showing here. And similarly, outbound emails per month, outbound SMS per month. If you want to track your communication, then you can see all this information here. So this is a dashboard which can be created uh, for our clients depending on their needs. So for the custom, like uh, for, uh, for one of the clients, I have created this dashboard. You can see that uh, this is a live workspace. It is used by the client. That's why there are actual values which are showing here like their January revenue, February revenue, how much they are making every month, this is showing here, and number of closings per month, um, deals that die, so deals which didn't respond, so dead deals are showing per month here, similarly closing sets, um, closing set for this month, so this will be showing here, depending on their team members, uh, it will show here, similarly profit per month, so this, this is a custom dashboard. It can be created for clients if they request something like this. And uh, there are different apps which are present here. Apps are just like tables. If you uh, are not familiar with Podio, these are apps. These are like databases. Okay. So if I uh, if I want to store uh, all of my seller leads, I must have created an app for that. Okay. This is a seller lead app. So if uh, similarly, if I want to store my cash buyers, there will be an, a, a, an app for them. Similarly, if I want to store some tenant leads, if I have some properties to whom I am managing, then in that case, this is a tenant leads app. For storing your properties, this is going to be the properties app. For storing your appointments, this is going to be the uh, appointment app. So, you know, you can see here that for managing your whole real estate business, there is an app. Like if you want to store your team members, there is a team members app. If your leads are coming from Craigslist, you want to bring them and then move them to the incoming leads app. Then there is an a in Craigslist app where uh, all of the leads which are coming from Craigslist, they will be stored here. So this is uh, like uh, this is uh, this will be the dashboard uh, which will look like once it is uh, set up for your business, once it is set up for your business and if you want to change it completely, completely it can be changed, but it's built on some standards. So it's it's built on some um, specific like uh, you know uh, uh, like uh, by some developers who have years of experience in uh, developing systems in Podio and also uh, you know they are aware of uh, business needs of uh, uh, clients from real estate industry. So I will go into these apps one by one. So you can from this dashboard you can get an idea that how uh, you can analyze your data. So uh, you can get an idea that how your business is going. On left side, you can see that there is an activity which is showing here. Anyone, if changes anything, if you want to see into activity section, then you can see it here. Okay, all the activity, if you want to load more activity, it will show here. So uh, everything, all the activity will show in this section. All the activities you are performing, they will be in the left side. And these are the apps, they are called as apps. If you want to uh, see the structure of Podio, like how it is structured, then there I, I will show you that there will be multiple uh, workspaces. Like you can see that these are different workspaces, local house, you know, they are these are different clients for whom I am working right now. So uh, these will be the different, uh, different organizations uh, for whom I am working. This is an organization, this is another organization. So these are different organizations. And into an organization, there can be multiple departments. So in the same department, there can be some people who are communicating with each other. So you can say that these are the departments. So if I am in the Petronix REI solution, so it means that uh, everything, every member who is a part of this workspace, they can share information with each other, okay? But members of another workspace cannot see uh, this data, okay? So they must be a part of this workspace for seeing the data which is present here. I will uh, you know, create some uh, videos regarding 
the default features of Podio, but it can be connected with a lot of uh, other systems like other sources of leads and we can you know, connect it with uh, email marketing softwares. We can connect it with dialers and uh, you know, cold calling tools, similarly SMS tools, voicemail tools, uh, e-signature services. I will create a lot of videos which will explain these different things and uh, there are some default features like you can communicate with your team here. Um, similarly, you can uh, uh, you know have notification feature here. You can see that there are 35,000 uh, notifications which will be uh, which are showing here. So all the activity which is happening into system, I can see that here. Okay, so this is a great tool. It's highly flexible. If you are getting confused right now that um, what this uh, tool is going to have, I think that the future videos will help you in the series to understand completely like how this system will work and what is the purpose of creating these all apps and how they work together. So uh, keep on watching these videos and let me know if you need any improvement and if you have some suggestions for me. And also if you need uh, some custom, uh, you know, you have some custom requirements and you want your system to be changed accordingly or you are struggling with some integration, just let me know. I can help you with this. Thank you very much.